So today at the Human Rights Council, we'll be asking the member states to raise the urgent plight of President Pakane, and uh, they will have a copy of our UN submissions in hand, and we'll be able to review it and raise it from the floor. To, to encourage member states to raise this. So close supporters, associates, friends and family of President Pakane uh, came to me with this this plea, basically. And uh, they're very concerned for her health, for her well-being, and they also fear for her life. So right now, we're trying to save her. Since I got my doctorate in 2014, that I gradually kind of uh, incorporated my, my own company. We're appealing to President Moon as a former human rights lawyer. He is the current president, but he was also a practicing human rights lawyer. And so I think the sort of moral here is to do what's right on a human level as well as a political level. We've asked the Working Group on Arbitrary Detention to urgently examine her situation in detention uh, and to direct the national authorities to release her as soon as possible so she can get proper medical treatment. We are saying her detention is arbitrary because she is detained without a proper basis to keep her detained during a trial. So detention should not be the norm, it should be the exception. And it's not necessary to keep her in detention while her trial is going on. Alternatives such as provisional release, even with conditions, could be put in place so that as an elderly lady she doesn't have to spend time in detention when she could be treated in hospital properly.